Hey, welcome. I'm Steve, and I'm one of the founders of Whimsical. In this brief video, I'd love to show you around the app and explain how it's all set up. The idea behind Whimsical is to provide everything your team needs to go from idea to launch without switching apps. Let me show you what that looks like. Let's start with the workspace. The intent is that each company would have just one workspace in Whimsical. So in this case, the company is Acme Inc. You'll notice in the sidebar that I'm a member of a number of teams. We recommend mirroring the teams that exist in real life within your company. So we're already inside of the product team here. As you can see, each team can have files, projects, and posts. Let me walk you through each of them. I'm gonna close the sidebar so we have a little bit more space. Let's start with files. This is where you can put team documentation in the form of boards and docs. We'll look at docs first. Our docs allow you to nest other docs inside of them. We can click into this one here. Docs are really fast and powerful. They support markdown, they have tables, commenting, multiplayer editing. You can also nest boards inside of docs. Let's jump into this one. So in boards, you can do all sorts of things, including user flows, mind maps, sticky notes, sequence diagrams, wireframes, competitive research, you name it. We also have workshopping features like timers and voting. Let's go back to the team now. And I wanna show you projects. Projects bring together everything in Whimsical and here's what they look like. You have an overview tab where you can describe what the project is about and who's working on it. You can nest early documentation like brainstorming boards or user flows. You can embed Figma designs. It's really flexible. You have a post tab as well for project updates, check-ins, other types of discussions. Posts are great because they allow room for more details and discussion, and they keep conversation in the project where it should be. And of course, you have a task tab, which holds all the tasks and can be filtered and sorted in various ways. I'll hop into a task so you can see it. They're almost identical to docs in the way that they support markdown and embeds. And with our GitHub integration, code that's written for the task will automatically be displayed here in the backlink section. What's cool about projects is that I can create boards and docs and folders to keep all of my project documentation in one place. In this example, I have a board in a project and I'm showing a visual progression of tasks. What's especially helpful is that the color of the task is tied to the status of the task. So for example, I can open this one up and uh, when I move it to done, the sidebar turns green and the card itself turns green too. And the same thing works in docs where I can embed tasks as well. And when I go to the task view, I can see that the task is in the done column where I would expect it to be. Okay, bumping back out to the team again, you can see that teams can have posts too, just like in projects. You can use this for team-based discussions and with our Slack integration, you can set it up so that new posts automatically get added to the Slack channel of your choosing. Whimsical brings everything into one seamless workspace so you can work calmly without having to switch between a bunch of different tools. We really hope you like it.